Papa, my name is Janet Alas and Danny. I'm so grateful for joining with this Wonder With Us number. Thank you, Papa. Thank you for bringing us all to God. Thank you so much. Since I joined this Wonders With Us number, making one year today, when I come back from Awuchi on 17, on 18 August last year, I joined this 
platform then all my prayer life are changed my family uh, problem are, 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 are okay we all of us we are okay we are free now i'm here since the day you announce that somebody is uh, having problem for his eye i kid of it since that day my eyes are clear i'm okay i think god of wonder with us number i restored my health my financial i received miracle money blessing all the time now i can read the word of god like ever before i can pray like ever before i can stay two hours without prayer reading the word of god it's you that challenge me the day when you announce that you read the word of god till uh, on reach 46 times in every day i say what am i doing god help me he give me grace i start two years now and too much i start reading the word of god every day i'm three times i'm in the book of daniel now thank you jesus thank you papa thank you for restoring my life restore my prayer life restore my health thank you so much god will continue to bless you oh lord thank you good morning wonders with that number family my name is prophet moses Eromose. S.O.P. Bayasa, the son of my father, Apostle Professor John Suleiman. On the 1st of September, while we were preparing for our communion service, we went to church at about 5 o'clock. We were preparing, and suddenly, exactly 5.30, Papa was already on, we were praying with him. Suddenly, a woman appeared in front of our church with clothes covered. Definitely, she was a witch. She said, you have been disturbing us. You will not allow us to rest in this area. I know it was the wonders with that number broadcast that was on that one that exposed witchcraft. Because before this time, we've been having a series of challenges that we don't even know where it's coming from. But on that day, it was exposed and they were disgraced. I want to say thank you, my Father and the Lord, for the opportunity for praying on this platform. My time has come. I am global. Good morning, Papa. My name is Judy Tanya Bini. I'm making this video for Mula Toki. I want to thank God for my life and that of my family members. During the last Holy Ghost conference, Papa made mention of bringing our family photos to the program. I was participating online, but I connected by faith. And Papa prayed on the photos. A week after, my mom called me and shared a testimony that she enjoyed one week miracle credit and not just that she got a new phone that she could be using to participate in the morning prayers wonders without numbers my second testimony was on the 8th of august papa made a prophetic declaration that six people who their helpers have left them will come back and remember them and we're among the people and one of our brothers who is to help us called my mom and sent each and every one of us huge amount of money and we're so happy thank you so much papa for all your prayers and prophetic declaration may god continue to bless you strengthen you and protect you thank you jesus my time has come hallelujah i want to bless the name of the lord i want to thank god for his faithfulness for his mercy for his protection over my life and my family i want to thank god for this child here when i was pregnant the last the last month of this pregnancy was not easy the pain was so severe so i went to the hospital and the doctor said it's the baby is okay it can come out now so i did operation to make this child to come out after that operation i came home as i came home as i came home that day after five days doing that operation for this baby to come as I came home, I was the one taking care of this baby by myself with pain, with pain, with tears, with I was so I was in pain. I was crying. And I told God that if God help me, give me the strength to take care of this child to this age, I'll come and testify in this platform. And today the child is three months old now. And I want to thank God for giving me that strength, for giving me that power to take care of this child and to take care of, and to take care of the order of my son. I want to thank God for that. And I want to also thank God for this child's life. It was not easy at all. The attack on this child's life was so severe. 
was so severe, but God see this strike shy is true. He protected the child and he disappointed the, the, the devices of the crafts. I want to thank God for, for, for that. I want to thank God. And I also want to thank God for the anointing oil your papa breast. I applied for my left breast and the pain disappeared. I want to thank God. Indeed, my time and my family time has come. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. My time has come. Good morning, Papa. My name is Paul Daminabal from Putagot. I want to appreciate the God of wonders with that number. The God of wonders who is faithful to me and my loved ones, who is my joy is a joy. I say, God, thank you. I want to thank God that He has delivered my senior sister from death. He has delivered my loved ones, my brothers and sisters, I say God, thank you. I want to also thank God that the marriage list of my sister, daughter Mo, has been out, has been released after months of being with her. It has been released, and I will believe God very soon the marriage celebration will begin. I want to also thank God for this platform. God has used this platform to transform my life, to protect me, to guide me, to fight my battles for me, to deliver me from these battles and challenges. I want to also, also thank God for helping me. You know, thank God that God gave me the grace to pray more, to read my Bible, to study. I want to thank God that He is helping me, favoring me, delivering me, rescuing me. I want to thank God for everything God has done for me through this platform. Love you, Papa. Thank you for answering the call of God in your life. Thank you, Jesus. My time has come. Hallelujah. Good morning, everyone. Good morning, Papa. Good morning, Wonders Without Number family. I just want to give my test. My name is Patkat Idu. I'm in Joss. I live in Joss. I want to thank God for my husband who has been searching for a job for quite some time now. For actually more than two years, he's been without a paid job. And he's a medical doctor. His hard desire was to get a job in a, in a federal institution. Um, Last month, two of his colleagues called him and um, he got the offer to work in a federal hospital without an interview and he's already started working there. So I really want to thank God for this testimony. I also want to thank God for my own. I have been in a research study and the study is about finishing. But I want to thank God that before the study finish, I already have two research studies I'm going to be involved in very soon. So I want to give God all the praise. My time has come. Good morning, Papa. I really want to thank God for God of Wonders Without Number for His kindness towards me and for the gift of life towards me and my family. It was on on Sat on Sunday night, so I was at home. So I decided to cook something. Then I put rice on fire. I was now in the living room for me to just relax. I don't know what happened to me. I just slept off. And this thing was happening around 9 p.m. That's when I, I put the food on fire. And I just suddenly I just find myself that I slept off. I slept off. Before I could woke up, all the whole house is filled with smoke like <laughs> everywhere was filled with smoke so i don't even know how god woke me up that day how god woke me up like before i could go to the the whole price i was cooking got burned i just thank god that is not more than that because i don't know what my enemy is planning but i know that his angels Watch it so bad, wonders with that numbers family. I give God all the glory. My time has come. Good morning, Papa. Good morning, wonders with that numbers members. Firstly, I want to thank God for my life. I joined wonders with that number 2021. Since 2021, since then, God has been doing great things in my life. I want to thank God for my life. And my prayer life have changed has improved secondly i want to thank god for yesterday yesterday i was at home my neighbor rushed and called me 
so before i get there i see that our son slumped fainted so people gathered and we were shouting the next thing i the first thing that came into my mind it was the anointing oil so i took the anointing oil and give the baby put it in his mouth and also anoint him and the boy wake up again thank you jesus my time has come i want to thank god for this miracle i want to testify for what god has done in my life Ne took my hand for about three months now this is a place and when papa was praying this morning i connect my hand papa mentioned that the bones are tapping because the bones have been pinning in this hand then cram numbness so as i stretch my hand to the scream i claim it i amen i receive that's how the hand just becoming light now like this the hand is light i cannot shake the hand like this but now i'm okay the hand is light i want to give god the glory because he god just healed me this morning I'm so happy. My time has come. I wonder with that number has been a blessing for me. I, I give God the glory. I love the program. Good morning, Papa. Good morning, Mama. We thank God for your grace. We got the wonders of that number. It's keeping me in this land. We thank God for your grace in this land because in Kuwait it's not easy. The grace of God is keeping me the tent as the angel. They are coming from my rescue in Kuwait because it's not easy in Kuwait. Kuwait is a country, it's not easy, but a God of wonders with that number, the 10th of the angel that protect me in this land day and night. And the prayer of Papa protect me, guide me. Always, Papa is praying for you, Papa. So I'm just to thank God. God is faithful. God is excellent. Thank God. A God of wonders number is wonderful. Please, God is keeping my time as come and in a bridge. I'm a Cameroonian working in Kuwait. Hi, I want to thank the God of Wonders with that number for coming through for me. So in July, my passport was with my former employer and I had done everything for him to give to me, but he didn't give to me. But by the grace of God, Papa um, declared that may our passport be released. And I claimed it, I said amen to it, and I believe it. And by the grace of God, my passport has been released um, to me and I'm very grateful and also anytime that Papa declares um, receive a miracle money I always say amen to it and I receive it and by the grace of God I've been receiving miracle money so my miracle money and I've come to give all the glory to the God of wonders without number and I thank you Papa for always um, praying for us and standing in the gap we appreciate it and may God bless you so much thank you Good morning, Papa. My name is Lawrence. I'm making this video from Benin City, Nigeria. I was living in Russia with my family where I gave birth to my children there in Russia. So, Papa, things were so rough, things were so difficult. So, I decided to go back home. I sent in a prayer request to one that without number platform. I sent a prayer request that God should please, God of Apostle Joseph Suleiman should please. Make a way for me. I should bring Epa to help me. Because there was no money. I don't know how I would do it. But all I know that, all I know is that I want to go back home. So my children can start school. My children were not going to school there. So I sent in the prayer request to wonders with that number. God of Apostle Johnson Suleiman answered my prayer. He sent some organizations. They helped me. They brought me and my children back home. They help us back home. And they also help us with an accommodation. They help us with an accommodation. And they also opened a shop for me. Papa. They a shop for me. I am talking to him in the shop. My children are sitting going to school. They are in school now. Thank you, Jesus, for your time and school. Dear Wonders Without Number Partners, We've got complaints about inconsistently monthly deductions and the frustration of repeatedly entering your card details. We appreciate your patience and we are here to make things better for you. In solving this problem, we are introducing PushPay as an additional payment option. This will enhance your giving experience, making it easier, faster and more secured. 
to use Pushpay, you have two options. One, visit the Wonders Without Number website where you will find step-by-step -step instructions on how to set your giving through Pushpay. Number two, keep an eye on your email box for a simple guide from us that will walk you through the process. Thank you for your continued partnership and God bless you. My time has come. For 31 years. 31 years. This is the first 31 years. She's working. 31 years. Amen. Believing God for a baby. Two babies, not just one. That's what it is. He was blind. He Hello, God bless you. Welcome to One That's Without Number. My time has come. Amen. We are still celebrating the grace of God for the month of April. We are excited and happy that God has kept us alive. You know, there is nothing you can pay for life. Anytime you see a new day, it's a ray of hope. It's a new beginning. It's a beginning of beginnings. It doesn't matter what has happened before. So long the Lord has kept you alive and well, is a proof and a pointer that there is hope and there is a tomorrow. I want to agree with you. The Bible says in Jeremiah 29, 11, I know the thought that I take towards you, thoughts of peace and not of evil, to give you an expected end. And I repeated it in Psalm 139, verse 17. Is how precious are thy thought towards me, O God? Great is the sum of them. The thoughts of God for you are great. It doesn't matter what you're going through, Isaiah chapter 55 and verse 8. His thoughts are not your thoughts, neither his ways your ways. As the heavens are higher than the earth, verse 9, so are his thoughts and your thoughts and his ways than your ways. So I want to believe God has a plan for you. He has an agenda. He has a purpose for you in life. Don't give up. No matter what you're going through, don't give up. Be strong in the Lord and in the power of his might. We are excited at what God is doing, but above all, amongst all rather, is the testimonies of people becoming better Christians because that is the essence of why this platform was created. God said to me, raise up people to pray. So the the motive was to raise up men and women to be trained and groomed and tutored and drilled and baked and schooled in the act of praying. Not just praying, praying scriptural prayers, praying in line with the word of God because the word of God is the will of God. And in First John 5, 14, the Bible says, whatsoever, this is the confidence we have, that whatsoever we ask according to his will, he heareth us. His will is his word. His will is is his word his will is his word his will is his word his will is his word so i believe god with you that something great and powerful is going to happen in your life of the month is from first Samuel chapter 7 and verse 12 first Samuel chapter 7 verse 12 Samuel put a stone between two cities between Mizpah and Shen and called the name of it Ebenezer so if you are watching by television call somebody to get seated with you and tell them if there's a man to pray there is a God to answer if there's a man to pray there is a God to answer if there's a man to pray there is a God to answer there's a man to pray there is a God to answer there's a man to pray there is a God to answer if there's a man to pray there is a God to answer there's a man to pray there is a God to answer there's a man to pray there is a God to answer there's a man to pray there is a God to answer there's a man to pray there is a God to answer there's a man to pray there is a God to answer there's a man to pray there is a God to answer there's a man to pray there is a God to answer if you are watching online touch the like button and begin to share the link share the link and share through keep sharing until you share through share and share and share all right today is a very special day the bible tells us in the book of first second chronicles rather chapter 12 and verse 18 when david was being prayed for second chronicles 12 18 first chronicles sorry 12 18 let's see what the bible says it says first chronicles sorry 12 18 
Then the Spirit of the Lord came upon Amasa, who was chief of the captains. He said, Thine are we, David, on, and on thy side, the son of Jesse. Peace, peace, peace be unto thee. Peace to thine helpers. Peace to thine helpers. Peace to thine helpers. Peace to thine helpers. For thy God helpeth thee. Then David received them and made them captains of the band. We're going to pray today for helpers. Don't forget, this is a month of Ebenezer, our, our helper. Ebenezer, our, our helper. Ebenezer, 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 our helper. Listen to this. Every man in life needs helpers. No matter how talented or gifted you are, the profession, your vocation, your craft, your giftings, no matter how gifted or talented you are, you need somebody to recommend you. Somebody has to recommend you. Jesus, the Son of God, was the Lamb of the world. Nobody knew until John the Baptist is a priest. Following the order of his father, Zechariah, because by, by reason of Zechariah's um, lineage, John the Baptist was respected. John the Baptist stood up and said, Behold the Lamb of God. So it was the Lamb of God walking on food. Nobody knew. Until John the Baptist had to identify him. You must understand that helpers are needed. Paul one time was praying and was speaking. In Romans chapter uh, 16 verse 3, he first of all identified. He said, Greet Priscilla and Aquila, our helpers in Christ. In verse 9, he mentioned the name of another helper. Actually two of them. He said, Greet Salute Ubani, our helper in Christ and statues my beloved in second corinthians 8 23 he spoke about one called titus who was his helper he said wherefore do inquire of titus is my partner and fellow helper concerning your brethren be inquired of the messengers of the churches and the glory of christ so helpers are important to destiny you can't go far without a helper moses a great man next to chapter 7 someone had to hold his right hand and another his left hand Aaron and all he was anointed but somebody had to hold his hand. Oh Lord, give me destiny help us. Oh Lord, I want us to pray this prayer today. And please, throughout today, after this session of prayer, in the next two, three hours, pray it again. Oh Lord, give me destiny help us. Oh, life is not hard. It is help us you lack. Life is not hard. It is help us you lack. Oh Lord, arise. Give me destiny help us. Oh Lord, arise. Give me destiny help us. Oh Lord, arise. Give me destiny help us. Oh Lord 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 arise. Give write that down on your platform. Write it on your page. Oh Lord arise. Give me destiny help us. Write it on your WhatsApp story on every platform you have. Oh Lord arise. Give me destiny help us. Oh Lord arise. Give me destiny help us. Oh Lord arise. Give me number one. Oh Lord arise. Give me destiny help us. 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 Lord arise, give me destiny help us. Oh 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 Lord arise, give me destiny help us. 
Oh Lord, arise, give me destiny, help us. Oh Lord, arise, give me destiny, help us. Oh Lord, arise, give me destiny, help us. Oh Lord, arise, give me destiny, help us. Oh Lord, arise, give me destiny, help us. Oh Lord, arise, give me destiny, help us. Oh Lord, arise, give me destiny, help us.
help us, destiny help us in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen. You will no more be stranded. You will no more lack help us. You will no more lack help us in that your vision, that assignment, that career, that profession, that vocation, that mandate. Help us to boost your, your talent. Help us to bring out your capacity. Help us to lift you and hold your hands in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Someone, someone, you have a book. A lot to you to write out books. You have written two. And you need somebody to help you publish them. You have no money. God say help is coming. Help us are coming. I see a singer also. God is pushing your, your singing ministry to an international level. By reason of help, you are going to get a visa. And that visa would, that would be the beginning of your expansion taking you around the world. God is going to do that for you. In the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. I speak the grace of God upon you. I speak a testimony in your life. In the name of the Lord Jesus. Amen. First testifier. Good morning, Papa. I joined this prayer platform early 2022. I've been battling with near success syndrome, spirit wide molestation, bad luck, and limitation. But indeed, God answers prayers. One day, Papa declared, receive miracle money. And a 6.3 million naira credit alert woke me up. <laughs> woke me up from sleep. Secondly, I've been believing God for a contract. To my surprise, I was credited 780 pounds by my employer and I got my first care agency contract. Thank you, Jesus. My time has come. This month, may God give you financial surprises in the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. Next testifier. Good morning. Good morning, Papa. I joined this platform in September 2022. My prayer life has been, has been affected positively and I've been enjoying miracle money since then. To, to be honest, I wasn't believing in miracle money before until God proves me wrong that miracle money is real. On the 9th of February 2024, I received miracle money and during the Zambia crusade, Papa declared we shall receive financial miracles within, 24, for, within 48 hours. I connected to that prophecy. I checked my account and found 500 rands deposited without any trace. Thank you, Jesus. My time has come. Pastor, welcome. <laughs> Pastor, welcome from South Africa. Pastor, welcome. You are welcome. More testimonies to you in Jesus' name. Amen. Let's testify. Good morning, Papa. I want to thank the God of wonders without number for a miracle job he gave me. On the day of the interview, of interview, I went there early before the interview I came. I called on the angels of wonders without number to take control. And it happened that the questions were so simple for me. Thank you, Jesus. My time has come. Mrs. Ogochuku from the UK. I decree the Holy Ghost give you insight where you need insight. Holy Ghost give me insight where I need insight. You may say it's simple. It wasn't simple to all that might be hard. But the Holy Ghost gave you insight. Holy Ghost give me insight where I need insight. Let's take the next testifier. Good morning, Papa. I want to thank the God of wonders without number for a miracle job. I wrote a prayer request two weeks ago asking God to give me a miracle job. To my greatest surprise, someone approached me for a job. I went for an interview the next day and was told to resume the following Monday. Thank you, Jesus. My time has come. Grace from Ghana. Holy Ghost, give me insight where I need insight. Holy Ghost, give me insight where I need insight. Say, my father, my father. My father, father my, my father, father. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. As I begin to pray. As I begin to pray. Holy Ghost. Holy, Holy Ghost, Ghost. Give me insight where I need insight. Give me insight where I need insight. Holy Ghost. Holy Ghost. Holy Ghost. Holy Ghost. Give me insight where I need insight. Give me insight where I need insight. Open your mouth and fire prayers.
somebody who has a problem you are a lady you have a problem and you don't understand your body system is changing like somebody who just had a baby but you don't have a baby all the symptoms of somebody who just had a child liquid coming out of some parts of your body all kinds of things but you don't have a child you didn't just have a baby and they give it some medical name and whatever it is right now i see the power of god fixing that making you well in the name of jesus christ amen if somebody wearing a black suit black tie white sleeves inside you are praying i don't know if you are going out you just want to pray alongside but you are having a challenge in your job you are about to go and face a panel the lord says i should tell you that he will go ahead of you and he will give you a testimony he will vindicate you he will turn the case and the matters in your favor in the name of jesus christ amen let's testify Good morning, Baba. Two of my colleagues went to work, ganged up to conspire evil against me. They defraud me of company goods given to me. I went behind to report to the company. It became a big challenge, which gave me sleepless night. On Sunday night March, I prayed that God would vindicate me and render them restless to return the goods within 48 hours. In less than 12 hours, they called to return the goods, and I've been vindicated. Secondly, my phone was restored after I used the anointing oil on it. Thank you, Jesus. My time has come Daniel Kubajo from Ghana. I decree the Lord God Almighty will fight for you and deliver you from every gang up in the name of Jesus. Amen. Let's testify. Good morning, Papa. Since I started following one that's without number from inception, my love for scriptures has increased. I memorize scriptures. My prayer life has improved tremendously. I receive miracle money on countless occasions. Thank you, Jesus. My time has come. Emmanuel Chinedum from Johannesburg, South Africa. In the name of Jesus, may God give you grace to grow more in Him, in the knowledge of Him, in Jesus' name. Amen. Let's testify. Good morning, Papa. My name is Rabbi from Ghana. On the 29th of January, 20, 29th of January, during the morning prayers, Papa mentioned that someone has cholesterol issues and God is correcting it. It was me. I had the cholesterol issues since last year i was taking medications to low it down i just returned from another test and the doctor said i should either continue the medication or to diet and that day papa mentioned my case thank you jesus my time has come let's watch the video you have cholesterol issues somebody has issues with cholesterol the 
Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. We are going to pray, Lord, deliver me from every evil satanic gang up. Oh, Lord, deliver me from every evil satanic gang up. Oh Lord, deliver me from every evil Satan. Say in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Loud and clear. In the name of Jesus. Louder than that. In the name of Jesus. Oh Lord. Oh Lord. Deliver me. Deliver me from every evil satanic gang up. From every evil satanic gang up. Oh Lord. Oh Lord. Deliver me. Deliver me from every evil satanic gang up. From every evil satanic gang up. Oh Lord. Oh Lord. Deliver me. Deliver me from every evil satanic gang up. From every evil satanic gang up. Oh Lord. Oh Lord. Deliver me. Deliver me from every evil satanic gang up. From every evil satanic gang up. From mouth and fire prayers. Evil satanic gang up. Shatter, 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 shatter,
The Lord said, Shall I rise for you? Connect your faith to my faith. I connect every gang up and every conspiracy against you. Scatter in the name of Jesus. Amen. Every gang up, every conspiracy, wherever the gang up emanates from me, the Lord arise for you. Arise for you. Arise for you. Fight your battles. Fight your battles. Fight your battles. Fight your battles. May God fight your battles. May God fight your battles in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. My Father, Celebrosa manta la gradish. Vretisha paradusa man cradahas. Somebody with pains on the rib, you have been healed by God. Both sides of the ribs. Both sides of the ribs, you are healed. Somebody called Yvonne. The hand of God is coming upon you. And God is setting you totally free from the attacks of the wicked one. In the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. This is what God said I should tell you. There's a veil that covered you and help us can see you. You only get help. But right now that veil is 
may your real identity appear before your helpers and may you be helped in the name of Jesus Amen. somebody called Abigail God is sorting the issues of your marriage the issues of your marriage Ma Maya 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 there's a problem um, there's an hormonal problem something's affecting your conception but God is fixing that now in the name of Jesus. Amen. Somebody's watching Nigeria, Ninja State. You are a couple crying to God for a baby. The Lord has granted your desires in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. I speak the hand of God upon your life, the grace of God upon your life. In Jesus' mighty name. Amen. If you are sick in body, put your left hand where you have that problem. Stretch your hands to me. I decree be healed. Be made whole. The hand of God touch you. The hand of God set you free from your head to your toes in jesus mighty name amen amen let's take our offerings and the lord bless you as we do that 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 bless you the Bible says we must not appear before the Lord empty as you give today may your heavens be open we must not appear before the Lord empty three times must you appear before him said the Lord and shall not appear before I decree that as you give today may you be blessed may your heavens open perpetually in Jesus mighty name amen amen next testifier good morning baba i want to thank god for my healing i've been having irregular periods for a year now sometimes not seeing it at all for months my bad migraines and skin reactions but i'm healed now to the glory of god my laptop also stopped working after a huge amount of water spilled on it and refused to turn on for days but after I applied the anointing oil, Papa Bless, it turned on miraculously and has been working perfectly since. Thank you, Jesus. My time has come. In the name of Jesus, may you experience the strength act of God. In Jesus' name. Amen. Next testifier. I want to thank God for healing my son of stomach pain. After applying the anointing oil, Papa Blessed, I want to thank God for divine provision that enabled me to pay my rent and fix my car. I want to thank God for favor. On 12th March, my boss called me to his office and blessed me with cash. Thank you, Jesus. My time has come. May help us favor you this season. In Jesus' name. Amen. Final testifier for today. Good morning, Papa. I am Uzoma Leo from Germany. I give thanks and glory to God for healing me of a long-lasted toothache and gum pains. So, as I obeyed Papa's instruction of placing my left hand where I need healing, and secondly, God, secondly, God preserving my wife's life from a car accident a few months back. Thank you, Jesus. My time has come. Father, we give you all the glory for this testimony as we take the blessing. In Jesus' mighty name. Amen. Amen. Let's ask God for a personal prayer request and desires. In Jesus name amen as surely as I leave numbers 14 28 hear the Lord as you have spoken in my ear so will I do unto you I decree the Lord grant your desires in Jesus name amen receive miracle money receive a pay rise where you work receive a better job and receive your citizenship your passport your permanent residence your work permit your visas your promotion letters your appointment letters be blessed in Jesus name amen all right take advantage of the information now showing on your screen 
call the Nigerian, US, and UK toll free number now, and somebody's waiting. Please, in case you call, you have complaints of people calling and say they can't get through. The numbers are busy. People call all the time. Call now and call through. The Lord bless you. Take advantage of every other information. May 21st, 22nd, and 23rd. 21st, we have a program and impartation service. I'll be ministering. 22nd, 23rd, myself and Pastor Benny Hinn will be ministering in New York. The Lord wants to bless you. I mean, it's a huge, massive meeting. And God can use you to be a blessing. There's an information, account information on the screen. You can see, Apostle, I want to swing to that program. Mind-blowing program. May 21st, 22nd, and 23rd. Actually, it's 22nd, 23rd, because 21st is an impartation service. Do that right now. If you're sending a seed to this platform, send your number to uh, a number you'll be, you'll be shown on the screen if you're sending uh, your, your seat to that information once you do that send your number to the engineer we have an engineer called engineer philip he, he, he's in charge of things like this you send your number to him and let him inform us so we can reach out to you and appreciate you i mean it's costing quite a, a whole lot and god can use you to make that happen and we're going to be mind-blowing meetings in the name of jesus let the lord use you let the lord use you in hundreds of thousands and thousands of us dollars god can use you to do something and do that reach out to him Stop. engineer i'm giving a hundred thousand dollars i'm giving ten thousand dollars i'm giving five thousand oh i can give a thousand dollars whatever it is as the lord lazy i just feel led i got sons and daughters who are willing to take this opportunity but i feel led to throw it open for somebody as we invade new york in the power of the spirit i'll see you again tomorrow don't you forget this. If there's a man to pray, there is a God to answer. Somebody say, my time has come. My time. Dear Wonders Without Number Partners, we've got complaints about inconsistently monthly deductions and the frustration of repeatedly entering your card details. We appreciate your patience and we are here to make things better for you. In solving this problem, we are introducing PushPay as an additional payment option. This will enhance your giving experience making it easier, faster, and more secured. To use PushPay, you have two options. One, visit the Wonders Without Number website, where you will find step-by-step -step instructions on how to set your giving through PushPay. Number two, keep an eye on your email box for a simple guide from us that will walk you through the process. Thank you for your continued partnership, and God bless you. My time has come. Venito da Haganilsko Balakashti Kubasha. Aluko Siki Banda Savana. Intimacy 2024. Boya. Cameroon. Apostle Johnson Suleiman. She has been bleeding for days, Papa. She was rejected from the hospital. Married to this crusade ground. Powerless. No strength. At the instance of the world, the bleeding stopped. Strength came upon her. The lady who was carried to this crusade and lifeless, she is standing, she is prancing to the glory of God. This woman that is running now was carried to this place. Two persons held up by the right and by the left. They carried her. They carried her to this place. They carried her. God bless you. On the 2nd and 3rd of April, I'll be coming. We moved the date before, but now we are coming. Second and third of April. I saw myself in your family, in the spirit. I'm not seeing father. He's dead. I'm He's looking at mother, dead. and I saw myself travel to America. She's She's in the US. The US. Date: Second and third April, 2024. The venue is at Boliko Stadium, Boya, Cameroon. 9 a.m. and 4 p.m. daily. The fourth of April, 2024. Ministers' conference for inquiries. Miss Cool. Please spread the news and tell everybody that Johnson Suleiman will be in Cameroon 2nd and 3rd of April by the instruction of God. So I'll see you in Cameroon. Do your best now to travel down to the nation of Cameroon. God bless you. Cameroon, your time has come. Our God is a consuming fire. Intimacy 2024, Toronto, Canada. Apostle Johnson Suleiman. God bless you. Johnson Suleiman is my name. I hope this message meets you well by the message of God. I'm coming to Canada. I'm coming to Toronto. Your tender a prophesier. For four years, he's been sitting on this wheelchair. He said, as you minister now, 
The power of God came upon him. He got up. Now he can walk. Joshua Tembo has been down due to heart complication. But as you minister tonight, the power of God came upon him. He just jumped up and began to run. On the 16th and 17th promises to be two days of outpour of the grace of God and open heavens. I'm believing God. I'm looking forward to seeing you in Toronto. As I looked there, I saw you now in the realm of the spirit. And I saw the Lord said, break the yoke of death. I see myself on a road and I saw a wind blowing on that road. I saw myself standing by a car and I saw you in the car. I saw a wind blow hit the tire of that car. I saw the tire pulling off. I saw the car come to a stop. And I see myself, I'm asking the Lord, I began to hear Bamenda. You have something to do, Bamenda. Yes, sir. 16th and 17th, April 2024, by 8 a.m. and 5 p.m. daily. Venues at Revival Time to Barnacle Worldwide Ministries, 4340 Dufferin Street, Downsview, Ontario, M3H 5R9. Phone quarry sent to be part of the local organizing committee is called the following numbers. I believe in God for Intimacy 2024, Toronto, Canada. I'll see you there. You will see the power of God. God bless you. Johnson Suleiman is my name. And I hope this message meets you well. Anything attacking your full joy, it crashes today. The overwhelming joy of salvation and restoration stretch to few vessels, a people who are willing by the Spirit. I will build my church and the gates of hell, not by power, not by might, but by the Spirit of God. Intimacy 2024, Kenya. Receive your sight. Eyes up! What's happening there? What's happening? What's happening? Papa Lucas! Is this how you celebrate Miracle Touch Kenya? Touch my head. Touch my head. Nine to tenth April, twenty twenty-four, at the Kenyatta International Conference Center, Nairobi, Kenya. Eight a.m. and three p.m. daily. There will be a leadership empowerment summit at the Western Hotel, Nairobi, Kenya. Join me and our team as we come with Intimacy 2024. Your life will never remain the same again as the sick will be healed, the lost will be found, the bound will be loosed, and the name of the Lord will be glorified. I saw somebody taking your picture, and the picture of two kids. I have two children. This same person took the picture of a man and killed him. My husband is dead. Where's your husband now? Who is hitting his head? He complains about his head. He told you migraine, that's not what I'm saying. His own uncle is the one hitting his head. For inquiries, please call. I'll see you in Nairobi. I'll sleep in Kenya. Thank you, Lord. Holy Ghost, make me your raw material. Refine me to be used for your beauty. Just for you and for you, Holy Ghost. This is my heart cry, Holy Ghost. Yeah, my heart cry. be more like you is all I pray. This is my heart cry, Holy Ghost. Yeah, my heart cry, Holy Ghost. More like 